What is going on, YouTube? It is your man's Mr. Dominic Cruz Fito on ABC, NBC, CBS, Yahoo, and Fox. Coming at you with another video. Yes, another one, another one, another one. Oh, hope you guys are trying for your purpose and mission in life. You guys are going out there, working hard for it, grinding out and getting rewarded for it because at the end of the day, I'm going to that purpose and mission in life. Good things do happen. Woo! All right. So, <laughs> I want... So there's been a lot of, well, I've been seeing this actually, and there's been a lot of questions on ghosting. You know, why would someone ghost you? You guys known each other for 10, 15 years. Why all of a sudden ghost? You think you know someone, and then all of a sudden they pull that kind of stunt on you. You really don't know them. Um, and, it, and, it kind of, and, it, and it sucks, right? Because you... Because it kind of makes you feel like you've put everything in, you put you put it all out there, and all of a sudden this person just says, psych! So, let me just say this real quick. I wanted to say this. I mean, if you're in a position where you are ghosted right now, you have no idea who where your ex is at. You have no idea what, who, when, where. You have nothing. You, you don't know. You only, The only thing you have is the last thought of them, right? And here's the thing. That... When you, when you're in that space, when you just don't know, you kind of just, you kind of just said whatever. I don't care anymore because they're not, they're not my life. They're not my priority. And you know what? They're not my problem. But when you're in a position to where you got ghosted, you're going. Obviously, there's, there's someone who is ghosted are going through the issues that they got ghosted, right? And there's a lot of questions on why would someone get ghosted. Let me just say this. I want to put this out there. Um, you know, when 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 what I think about ghosting is pretty much cowardice, right? Because if you can put your feelings out there, you can tell that person, you can make them feel all good and all that. You can communicate with how you feel in a relationship, right? You can communicate all of that, everything, 100% transparent. But you can't ghost. I mean, but you can't. Speak to them on the fact that I can't speak to you anymore. Um, I don't want to speak to you anymore. I really think we should go our separate ways. That kind of tells you the kind of person that they really are. And not only that, but you're dealing with a child. And what I mean by a child, someone that doesn't know how to communicate really effectively. You think they do, but they really don't. Uh, well, listen, if you're in a position to where you are ghosted, you're going to, at some point, you're going to just let go of the fact that it, it doesn't mean anything anymore. It, you're going to let go of the fact that, you know, I'm, you're just going to stop trying to figure out why you got ghosted. You know, there's at the end of the day, you're going to realize one day that there was never anything wrong with you. And that's because, like, if in the next relationship, the, the next relationship that you're in, you know... There may be someone, well, there will be someone, excuse me, not maybe, there will be someone that will help you realize that there was never really thing, there was never anything wrong with you. Now, let me, now, 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 let me go back to the ghosting. So here's the thing, when you, if you're ghosted, right, <laughs> and like I can understand and they told you they don't want to speak to you and stuff like that, but you keep persisting. You keep saying, no, 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 no. I want to keep on talking. I need your I need your attention, right? Then there's kind of a, then that's okay to say, okay, I don't need to really explain, explain anything because I already explained and, and I get it, so I'm just going to do it for them, right? But when you're in a position to where you're like, if the, 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 the ex is like, doesn't say anything, right? And you just go off the grid, it's like, and then when you get back on the grid, it's like, they ain't mean shit to me anyways. I mean, I once found them attractive and they're not attractive anymore, you know? So it, it really is, it really does come down to that. It's like, they were once attractive and then all of a sudden because of this little behavior that they pulled off and stuff like that, and you see them again, like, Phew! they're really not that attractive anymore. And in, in, in short, like... It goes along more than uh, beauty. Let's put it that way. So, uh, if so, just understand that if you are ghosted right now and you're just questioning, I'm gonna tell you this right now. 
it's going to fuck with your head for a little bit, but don't let it ruin your mental health. I, please, 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 ladies and gentlemen, please, please take care of your mental health. It is, and especially if you are taking isolation, you know, you're still isolated, you haven't gone out and stuff like that, please take care of your mental health. You know, um, I, I, I don't even want to go where I was going. It's just, let me just say a long story short. Whew. I'm glad I got my space, right? No puns intended, but, <laughs> but um, check it out. Take care of your mental health. If you're in a position to where you got ghosted and stuff like that, you know, just go through that process, you know, go through the whole process. Don't just try to avoid it. Go through it because when you go through it, there is a breakthrough. And remember, you know, create a new habit. And if you ever want to learn, get a new habit and stuff like that, it takes 21 days to develop a habit. It's not easy to start and it's not easy to be consistent with it. But I promise you, if you keep going for 21 days and beyond, it's going to become a lot easier easier trust me when i say that um you know read a book you know i recommended you guys a book on my live video uh, the other day and you know never eat alone by keith ferrazzi it's a great great book and it can really 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 help you narrow down on where you want to go in life and who you want to become and who you want to become is basically who are your associations so you know i i, I really took the whole you know, I, I take ghosting as like not only just cowardice, but like it really is disres- it's really, really disrespectful. And I know I understand that when you're ghosted, you feel like it's disrespect. It's like, yo, that's fucked up, right? <laughs> you have every let me just say this right now. You have every right to feel that way. That's like fucked up. Yes, you're supposed to move on, but at the end of the day, I mean don't be cold, like it's just don't be so cold on someone by keeping it like by leading them on and just being out of the picture, you know, because it kind of makes it seem like you are the bad person. And trust me, your reputation, be careful if the person, if you, let me just say this, if you have ghosted to someone, right, and that person took it to a whole, and, and, and let's just say the person that you ghosted, you know, they're offended by it, right? And because they got offended by it, they, they used it as fuel and they became so much more successful. Like they became like, this is, for example, Jeff Bezos from Amazon, right? They If they have that kind of power, it can hurt you a long, let's just say a, a long ways. That's a little extreme to say, but it could happen. And trust me, we're not, we're, we're, we're living in the times where <laughs> the craziest things can happen. All right. So... I, I, I get the whole thing where everyone is like, you know, they were living with their partners and then all of a sudden they're starting to see their partner's true colors and all of a sudden they just went ghosts and stuff like that. Listen, I'm going to tell you this. I'm going to be the only one to tell you this right now. If you recognize your own flaws, work on those flaws, but just know at the end of the day, there's not, there's not anything wrong with you. But if you know there's something wrong with you and you want to fix it, then it's up to you to fix it. But it's, don't rely on anybody else to fix it, all right? Because I understand when it comes to getting ghosted, I'd be like, oh, hell no. You done learn today. <laughs> Watch, right? And you know what? I wouldn't be surprised if, you know, any of my exes, like, Saw my stuff. I don't care. At the end of the day, they're still not my life. So it doesn't really matter. Uh, <laughs> uh, but, I, you know, in this situation, though, in a, in a real serious, in a real, 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 real serious note, really take care of your mental health because it really can hurt you. Because the anxiety can go up. And not only your anxiety can go up, but you can become really anxious and then you can be really impatient and then your emotions take over and you start doing the dumbest things. And you don't want to do anything stupid that's going to, that, you don't want to do anything stupid because you let, because of your emotions. I mean, literally, when logic, when emotions are high, logic is low. When logic is high, emotions are low. So you basically would see everything with the magnifying glass So when logic is high. Um, but if you're in a position that you got ghosted, you know, go through the process, all right, and go through the process, you know, write 
on uh right if you have an ipad ad, you know type you know write in the journal you know and then and then like you know if you want to keep it keep it if you want to just like rip it up and th throw it away throw it you know kobe that uh all right <laughs> rest in peace kobe but um you know it, it, it's really important that we don't avoid these things that we don't avoid you know our like what's going on with us eh? because at the end of the day it's okay to admit that it's not that i'm it's okay to admit that you're not okay and that you need to figure out why you're not okay. It's okay to admit it. But you know what's also okay to, to admit? That it's that you're not okay. And that's okay because I'm going to fix it. So, whew, man, I, I, I just, just had to get that out. Because, uh, you know, if it's hard for you to let someone go. And you know you love that person from here from, from here to across the universe right you do anything for them and that includes letting them go so even if you got ghosted let them go it's tough enough to accept the fact that they don't want to be with you and that's okay because they did you a favor anyway all right and then use the use the energy of like being mad, angry. Use that for success. Use that for something to where it's going to help you flourish in your career and flourish in your social life. Because I promise you, when you focus on the good things in life, it does happen. Good things do happen, all right? Why do you think I say what I say all the time in the beginning of my videos? Because good things do happen when you keep doing it, when you keep following your purpose of mission life. All right. But, um... Pretty much, that's the whole thing. So, guys, listen, if you like my videos, you know, please go into the description. Donate, of course, and I will be donating to a charity. You know, there, there's, there's, I'm, I'm basically doing a lot of, um, not only just charities, but I'm also supporting, you know, cultured businesses, black businesses as well, because, it, I mean, come on, man, like, their business are just, I don't want to get to this whole thing, but if you guys find this information valuable, I want you to drop a like, drop a comment, drop a share, and of course, it is your man's Mr. Dominic Cruz coming at you with another video, yes, another one, another one, another one. All right, guys, till next time, take it easy. Bye.